Devers ISD is a small town school district with a big impact on its community. It's kind of like a diamond in the rough for sure. It is a great place for kids first and for staff and we're a huge part of our community. I kind of like to think of us as the heart of Devers and um, as we beat, so the community beats. But the school district's success is no longer a secret. It's elementary school getting recognition on a national stage. Devers Elementary was named a 2022 National Blue Ribbon School. It is considered the highest award in education that an American public school can receive. This is a place like no other, and so that Blue Ribbon Award just really confirmed what, what we already know. There's um, students, staff, parents, teachers, everybody is really just top notch and there's, it doesn't get any better than Devers. So why mess with perfection? Well, four years ago, teachers at Devers ISD convinced Superintendent Elizabeth Harris to try something new, a four day school week. We only had, um, I believe it was nine families that were against it and um, five of those were stay at home moms so I think we were going to mess up their daily uh, routine a little bit. Harris says the biggest objection from them was what to do with their kids on that extra day off. My question is to that group what are y'all doing with your children during the summer because I know y'all are still working right and what are you doing during the two weeks we have off at Christmas because not everybody jobs affords them two weeks off or the week at Thanksgiving you just have to figure it out and you have to make it work so in 2019 Devers began what would be a three-year pilot program with the new schedule and it's now permanent policy a lot of school districts have gone to a four-day week for many reasons teacher retention trying to um, school districts that aren't able to kind of match their neighboring district as far as uh, salaries and stuff like that. There's lots of things. And there's, there's research that says it helps students and there's research that says it doesn't help students. We have found that it has helped students because we went from um, number five school district in the state of Texas to the number three school district in the state last year. And that's based on schooldigger.com, which does a, for a number of states, they rank school districts. Devers was one of the first districts in Southeast Texas to go to a four day school week. At least 76 school districts across the state have now switched to four day school weeks. 13 additional districts offer hybrid schedules with four-day weeks for part of the year. It's giving school districts options where they didn't have options uh, previously. The, you know, the, the state's uh, political policies have kind of, they, they've backed uh, our, our local school district leaders in, into a corner. There, there's not a lot of flexibility and there's no wiggle room in the budget anymore. And they, 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 they can't afford to make ends meet. They can't, you know, they can't pay their bills. They can't pay their teachers well enough to compete. Uh, it's hard and getting harder and harder to find people to, to, to uh, find good quality educators and and fill those classrooms and then fill all the support jobs that happen in the school district too. So um, so this was this has been something um, based on the school leaders that I've talked to that has uh, been very successful in opening opening up some um, some options for, for for school leaders. Haley Etheridge is the fourth grade teacher at Devers Elementary. She's taught there for ten years. Her daughter was a student when the district adopted the four-day school schedule in 2019. Etheridge says it's been good for both of them. We were really excited to give it a shot. You know, we thought it would be really great for kids, and it has turned out to be everything we thought it would and more. Um, the place that I see the where it has the biggest impact is on student burnout. Um, you know, those kids getting a three-day break versus just two um, is is life-changing it is for me um, and it makes a huge difference you know when we have those kids that are involved in a lot of extracurriculars um, just and kids getting to spend more time with their family it's it's just wonderful endeavors angel san juan reporting